That's the best brown trout I've ever had. <laughs> <laughs> we got Mark and Twain back here. Oh, there he is, there he is. <laughs> That's beautiful. Hi everyone, welcome to the channel. Today I am out here in the Mark Twain National Forest in Missouri. Me and Jake came up, we just got here, we're camping um, on the Eleven Point River. We've never been here before, so this is our first time, but just from what we've seen, it's a beautiful, beautiful river. There's a big spring that feeds this river and that uh, chills this water down, cold enough for trout to live in it. So up above, it's, it's warmer water, more of a smallmouth river, and then once the spring feeds this river, um, it gets cold and then you've got year-round trout for how many ever miles down. So it's Saturday. We're gonna camp tonight, Sunday night, Monday night, head back Tuesday, and we're gonna float uh, tomorrow and then Monday. So we're gonna do two six mile floats. Weather looks good for the next few days. A nice cold front came through, knocked it down, supposed to get down in like the 30s, I think, tomorrow. So tomorrow should be pretty chilly, but it's gonna warm up into the 60s and looks like it's gonna be a nice float. I've got the new raft. I've taken it out a couple times this year on shorter floats, but See if we can catch some trout out of it. We're gonna get camp set up, get the tent set up, cook up some brats, and enjoy a nice campfire. So. Work on my all right here we go we just unloaded got six miles here beautiful day we're gonna start off with a nymph rig and uh we'll see we brought a stream of rods but um we're gonna get after it wind's gonna blow us down river yeah it's funny how there was no wind until now <laughs> i know All right, we're about a mile down the river here. We've just been trying different stuff, just trying to figure it out. Um, we've just kind of been working this 50 yard stretch right here, paddling up just because we can see a bunch of fish in here, but we're just trying to figure out what they like. But um, yeah, we've seen one guide and then we saw four kayakers and that's 
that's it so far <clears throat> but it's about noon like i said we've only went a mile so still got about five more miles to go absolutely beautiful beautiful place out here will we pretty. it's will we pretty a lot of bait fish a lot of minners but i don't see any fish going after them so but we'll keep trying stuff and see if we can get a fish in the boat oh got him all right first fish on the 11 point <laughs> Beautiful fish. That was awesome. Oh yeah, that looks fishy. That looks fishy. Oh, fish on. Yes. Nice. I know, he's a dandy. I jumped right in the net. Good drift. There's got to be a fish right there. There's a fish. Come on. Oh, there he is. Oh, there he is. He got him again. <laughs> there you go. Battle wound on him. That's good. That was beautiful. Yeah. Yeah. Hey. Yeah. 15 inches, 14, 15 inches. Yeah. Heck yeah, dude. So what are you holding on to right here? Oh! <laughs> It's another dandy. Nice. Dude, that's, that's a, a nice that's one. a nice yeah. fish right there. Hey, don't there get back here. Oh no. He's in the moss. <laughs> <laughs> There he goes. Oh, was that your second cast? <laughs> yeah, my first. Oh, was it really? Yeah. <laughs> Heck yeah. Yeah, here we go. Here we go. Oh, I lost him, I think. Oh, he's still on there. Big shelf right there.
Oh. He's not bad. Well, we're about uh, almost three miles down, maybe about halfway, but uh, we kind of finally figured them out. Um, we're just using a little little green, uh, I don't know, what is it, like a little green jig, just really, really small uh, olive uh, jig, but uh, I don't know, we've got 11 or 12, but um, yeah, they've really started, started biting pretty good. It's warmed so. up, too. It's warmed up, yeah. yeah. But anyways. You don't, you don't know, man. But yeah, I don't know. You don't know. I don't know. <laughs> nice, dude. Bye bye. Oh, see you later. Come again. You can be my netter. I'm gonna net your fish for you. Man. Bye-bye. <laughs> Dude, we got kind of lucky there. <laughs> <laughs> looks like good fishing. Well, there's the tight out. Right up there. Wonderful day. Perfect float, really. Yeah. Me and Jake tanked turns rowing and learned the boat. The guy gave us a pretty good tip. Bounced off a few things. Bounced off a few rocks. Caught some fish. Pulled a hamstring. Jake stuck his paddle in the side of the boat and knocked me over. Hold my hammy. <laughs> well, we floated about six miles. I don't know, caught 20 plus fish. Just a great day. Took us a couple hours to kind of figure out what we were doing, but uh, this afternoon was fantastic. But yeah, that little guy right there, um, that's what we pretty much caught most of the fish off of. But, but yeah, just an excellent day. We're going to wait for this gentleman to load his boat up and then we're going to load ours up, head back to camp and we're going to cook some catfish tonight. Some fried catfish. So, wonderful day. Great weather. Couldn't really ask for a better day. Raft did good. We learned some lessons. We're going to try it again in the morning. Tonight on the menu we're gonna we're gonna do some fried catfish here. Let's throw some Frank's red hot in there. There's all lead up. All lead up. I'll let that sit for about 15 minutes and then uh, 
throw this Zatarans in there with him. fishing and now we're eating some fried catfish. <laughs> bon appetit. Let me know what you think. Damn, that's the best brown trout I've ever had. <laughs> no, it's good, man. It's good? Mm -hmm. Up on the menu this morning is some deer sausage. His dog showed up last night. They can't. They basically just showed up and hung out and been here all night. Um, they're good dogs. I don't know if somebody dropped them off or what, but. We just started calling them Mark and Twain. Mark is the uh, the ugly one. <laughs> Twain is uh, more the sensitive type. We really, we got to know him pretty well last night. They've just been chilling right there. They went over there and laid down last night. Just I don't know if somebody dropped them off or what. There's no houses for a long way, so. Um. Hey Jake, breakfast is ready. Jake, breakfast is ready. You want some? You want some breakfast? Mark. Twain, we'll see you later. Maybe you'll be back. <laughs> oh, you're making me feel bad. Mark, Twain, don't look back, Jake. All right, day number two on the 11 point. We got Mark and Twain back here following us. So they showed up at camp last night. They stayed with us all night and uh, we went down to the boat ramp to unload the, the boat this morning and um, they uh, they followed us down there. And the boat ramp's only, I don't know, a few hundred yards from camp. But uh, but now they're wanting to go down the river with us and I'm, we're afraid they're gonna drown themselves. But they even swim out across the river and they're wanting to get in the raft for this, but I don't, I wouldn't mind putting them in the raft, but. I don't know if they'll pop it or what. Their, their toenails have probably never been clipped. I don't know. It's pretty tough stuff. But oh, they're going up alongside the bank now. Or that's Mark. There's Mark. We named him Mark and Twain. That's where the Mark Twain National Forest, but I don't know. But day two, it's gonna be a beautiful day. It's gonna get a little warmer than it was yesterday. Here he comes, dude, are you kidding me? That sucker's gonna swim across. There's the both of them. Anyways, we're oh, gonna try to climb up on a tree. He's climbing. Up, he's trying. They're trying to take that tree across the river. <laughs> we're gonna try to figure out what to do with these dogs.
you, Sam. There we go. Fish on. Kidding me? There they are. Jeez. Bye bye. Goodbye. Getting a little braver here. I want to. We walked the raft around the bend last time, but I'm gonna try it. Let's see what happens. All right, we swapped swap spots. We went maybe a mile, mile and a half down river, and um, Jake's taking over the boys, and I'm gonna fish a little bit. But we caught one fish, but this is where we really started catching them yesterday. Oh, fish shot. Fish on. Yeah, first little smallmouth on the trip. He's a big one. He's a big one. Well, we're about halfway down. It's been a good morning. Caught several fish. Probably warmed up to probably get close to 70 degrees today. So I haven't seen, there's only one group of kayakers. That's the only kayakers that we've seen on this trip. Um, or today, but yeah, we're gonna stop here and eat a bite and then um, got about three more miles to go and uh, Maybe Jake can catch a Catch a tank All right down the river we go uh, Paddle backwards Coffee. 
another otter out there. I don't know. We've probably seen nine or ten otters. It's the most. Seventeen. <laughs> we've seen a lot of otters on this river. More than I've ever seen on any other river. Nice. Fish on. Oh, oh. Got it. Heck yeah. Heck yeah. Looking water. Oh yeah, I'm in this spot. Big old cave right there. Camp out right there, man. You ain't left. One last cast. One, one last fish. There it is. There it is. Oh, you had him. We're approaching the end. It's been fun. Pretty cool place. Didn't see. Wasn't a lot of people, kind of had the river to ourselves a lot of the time. Great scenery. Great dogs. Fishing was good. We met two new buddies. We'll see if they're there when we get home, when we get back to camp. Mark and Twain. Here's the takeout. I'm gonna 